Generic greetings and welcome back once again to Prison Architect. Today's beverage is a quite interesting strawberry flavoured protein drink. I thought it was just a standard milkshake when I picked it up at the sort of discount section and it's not. It's still okay but also strangely gritty but there you are. Anyway, welcome back to Prison Architect in the previous episode Operation Expand Capacity and we got another four cell blocks so that's taken us to a total capacity of 58, 10 of those being uh, parent capacity and we do have some of those as well and overall we're in a pretty good situation We've got nearly 10 grand in the kitty and we are receiving just over 4 grand a day. We have, I guess, a couple of grants that we could potentially do, um, mainly the inmate nutritional research, and you normally want to do that sooner rather than later, but uh, yeah, well, I've picked the other stuff up now and... Uh, well, managed to get rid of our bank loan, which is good. So overall, pretty happy with that. In this episode, uh, quick build and click and then click because, quite frankly, more capacity, more better is the sort of aim of the game here. So in terms of managing the facility, there's nothing much that we really need to do. I mean, it sort of runs itself almost at this stage. Now we've got our patrols, we've got all of the regime, and because we've only got medium and low risk prisoners, we don't really have a huge problem. The only couple of issues we have is essentially the contraband and there's not much I can really do about it. I do definitely want to put something in this uh, family cells here in terms of maybe a dog patrol or maybe even some metal detectors. I think that would be reasonable. In fact, uh, yeah, let me do that now. Let's just go over to our objects and then uh, go to metal detectors. One, two will go in there. Over to our deployment patrols. And actually, I won't do patrols, but I will do assign dog handlers and just assign them to this area here. So instead of the patrols like I normally do, this is just assigning them to the room. So they'll just sort of wander around there. Sadly, though, we only have a couple of dog handlers, so one, two, three, and there we go. That's going to take our profit down, but, you know, at least something we can, uh, well, it's, it's, it's something that's uh, going to be used anyway. So that power cable is not in. Let me just connect that up like so, and also apparently that door servo is no longer <laughs> connected to anything electrical now that I've put that in. How strange. I'm going to prioritise the building of that because, quite frankly, I think that is a decent focus. Get that up and running. Um, we are currently at uh, 3 a.m. And there's a lot of money spent and we now don't have any money available. This guard is, I can say, patrolling, but they are, for some reason, not too keen on opening that door. May have been, oh, because they're on breaks, so we're just sort of heading out. Anyway, the metal detectors are now in and the door servo is now connected. So we should have not only someone assigned to this room uh, with a canine unit, also we have metal detectors, so hopefully we can find stuff there. We have one, two, three, four. Four uh, of the ten family cells filled. We are going to receive some more prisoners as we progress on. Naturally, as you get a lot of turnover, um, not just in case, not just in terms of the prisoners arriving and then leaving because their sentence is finished, and also the parole stuff. Um, we're going to get more family members. Over to prison grading, we've released six prisoners in total, so we need to release another four in order to get a grade. Um, over here, the workers are cracking on quite nicely. You can see that some of these are... They've still got... Why have, the, why have they got handcuffs on? I don't know why these guards have put handcuffs on them. One day in the prison... Ah, recent is found drugs. Okay. I mean, we should probably have a quick look at these prisoners as well to see what sort of... What sort of sentence they've got. <clears throat> So, Olivia Cow Cowell here, we've got zero six years served of four years. We've got Slater here, who served half a year of two years. We've got uh, Hereford here, who served 1.7 years of three. So, this, I mean, that's four years. Nine years, That what's that one? Nine years for money laundering. That's 12 years. Yeah, you've got, you know, ones like that. Uh, four and a half, uh, two and a half two and a half yeah i mean you've got a lot of these that are serving up to maybe 10 years but because of the low risk prisoners we've not got a lot of uh, major sentencing and also major traits i guess but we haven't really checked that out for a while we've got extremely quick volatile fearless this and this uh, cell block these two obviously these are the very first ones that we made so those are the ones that have um the the normal risk prisoners the medium risk so, aye, that's what we have. It's, uh, yeah, it seems to be working okay. Still working on the reform through education initiative. I can probably look at our, probably look at our 
programs now so we've got foundation education uh 32 are interested we could start up more on that and i think i will general education i don't need to do that workshop safety induction there is uh, a lot interested same as the kitchen but we're not running that the pharmacological treatment to drug addiction i'm going to start that back up again alcoholics group therapy will run that and spiritual guidance will run that as well so obviously that's going to spend more money so the daily cash flow will go down but hopefully reform and other things will go up and obviously it'll take care of these needs here which to be fair we do have a spirituality need of medium so they can go to the chapel and they can hopefully fulfill that need but it's not as good as when they actually do the full program as well so we have oh found some drugs we're actually finding them as they come in here it looks like our canine unit who is the canine unit wagglesworth brilliant <laughs> absolutely brilliant who is the handler the handler is i can hardly see them that's call so call is the handler and uh, wagglesworth is is the dog then you can hear the, the sniffing yeah you can hear them sniffing away there excellent i wonder who else we've got we've got uh who is that uh, Belver or something? Yeah, something like that. Uh, who's the handler? That's Tom the handler. We've got someone patrolling around here. We've got our Fang, the guard dog, with Edgecombe, the handler. I think we've seen Edgecombe before. We've got uh, Castle, the handler, and Chew Barker. Brilliant. Brilliant. Deserves a bit of a golf clap there. Won't do it too hard because it'll sound horrible on the mic. Uh, <laughs> but yes, Chew Barker. Absolutely amazing. If it's not punny, it's not funny. If it's not got a reference, it's uh, pointless. And I've just realised there that one of the f um, one of the mothers was going in in the classroom. Good, interesting. Anyway, how we're doing for money? Oh, it says we're running low on cash. Technically, we're doing uh, negative cash flow. Uh, but there's prisoner intake and shop intake and cash flow in general. But we're spending because we're building this on the left hand side. You understand? Interesting that we've got uh, someone turned up now. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Knight again. Isabel Knight. Can't keep on doing this. Don't know what I can do, though. Because they were... If you saw that there, as they came in... I know we were running a bit quick there, but as they came in... Went through the metal detector and... They were searched by the dog. I had the... I saw this, like, the sniff, 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 like, next to them, so they're being searched. And, oh! Hang on a minute. 38 grand? Have we just passed? We have! Wouldn't have called it. The reform through education initiative is already completed. Excellent. Let's go for inmate nutritional research now, which serve a single, low quantity, low variety meal. So, over to our policy. We want low quantity and low variety. It's not uh, non variety, so yeah, bear that in mind. Um, eat time, I'm going to change to just say free time of the day. That should probably do. And let's start working on that grant. Another thing as well, and people have mentioned this, or at least one person has, staff keys. Not something we've done. Staff keys. If enabled, all hired staff members will carry keys. Whilst this option, if selected, will improve efficiency within the prison, it also introduces additional security risk with more keys being in circulation. So it means that the guards and... Featherstone! we got a Featherstone. Um, yes, if we've got... Um, we've got the guards with keys, that's fine. But it also means that the... The cleaners, doctors, workers, etc. They all have keys as well. Do I want to do that? Uh, I'm not overly convinced. I'm not convincing myself that that is a good thing. Um, how are we doing for building? These are getting built. I'm going to not lock that door open because it ain't even built yet. However, that one is. So we will lock... If it's right near the bottom of the screen, it goes off the screen. So we'll lock it up. There we are. Um, and that door's getting built as well. Lock open. The levels of contraband in the prison are out of control, they say. Alright, well, I'll probably do something about that when I can. Don't know when that'll be, but, you know, we'll see. So, we're still serving our single low-quantity, low low-variety meal. The other grant is prison manufacturing facility, which is unlikely that we'll get done... It's uh, any reasonable time. 
and we can see that these are getting built as well. There's a couple more workers, I think. I think that's reasonable. I also want to spend a fair bit of money on putting some flooring in around here. Because, honestly, I think we just really want, would uh, benefit for some flooring. It would just look better. Especially in around the canteen and kitchen and stuff like that. I think that's what we're going to do. Oh, got some fighting. Who is this? Why are they fighting? Hmm. Machine Gray. 3337820. Enjoy. Let's enjoy prison life. Sentenced to 22 years for multiple crimes, including arson and perjury. Okay. Failed the foundation education program. Punishment is high, reform is low. Punishment high! Interestingly. <laughs> we don't have solitary cells, but punishment is high. Reform is low, security is middling, and health is middling. 62% estimated chance of reoffending. Okay. I wonder why they're kicked off then. Because they are volatile. That is why. Anyway, I was going to do a search, but quite frankly, we just haven't... Uh, haven't got the time to do it now that the day has come but we can run some electrical cable and some water pipes to our new cell blocks this one first because it is completed technically we also received some more prisoners and looks like no family members or anything so I think these are just two we just over egg these but, obviously, expansion-wise, north and south, more of these, you know, these will come into their own. But that's something we'll discuss in later episodes. We have a problem. Water pipe has burst and is flooding the area. Fix it before the damage becomes too severe. Yep. Yep, pipe's busted. Okay. See where that is. It's there. Pipe. Prioritize. Build, please. Looks like the, the visitors are still... <laughs> they're still cracking on with that one. Okay. Um, and the lawyers just went past. Right. Oh, God, good grief. Uh, it, was gonna, it was expanding out, but we're okay now. There's Subwoofer the dog and Fang. Subwoofer. Nice. Yeah. So we fixed that. And who's this? Yeah, it's that. Right, yeah. Anyway. Sorted. Good. So, we have this cell block to sort. They're putting in the flooring followed by everything else. Let's go ahead and set up our deployment patrols. Blue patrol, which we we normally use internally. I'm going to assign a guard there. I'm going to set up a blue patrol in here as well. Even though it's not built, we can still set it up. The only thing we can't do is if I messed up is right click to cancel it because then I think it will cancel that. Oh! Doesn't matter, it's already built. Right. Electrical cable, that'll run across. Large pipe, similar thing. That didn't work. I definitely clicked on it because I heard the I heard the clunk of me uh of uh, me placing it or clicking on it. Anyway. No big dramas. No drama llamas around here. There we are. Okay. So both of those are in. Capacity is increasing. We are now on to 74 capacity. Still want minimum security to try and get more family members. Once they're done with the heating and lighting and stuff. I say heating, we've got no... We've got no um, heating on. We, had, we didn't put on the weather and temperature. Weather and temperature is something that we will be definitely doing in the next series. Let's see about the common room. Let's see about the common room. I want... Kits for the exercise need. Probably some... Some of those. Some weight benches. Actually, I don't think I need four sets of weight benches. Those can go there. Hmm... I'm not going to put bookcases in because I think a table tennis table or something would be a bit better. 
Although there would be problematic because of where the weight benches are. There would be fine. Um, but I do want a bookshelf in here, in each of these. There we go. So that's catering for exercise need and recreational need. But I haven't yet got any phone booths. I might put some gym mats in as well. Yeah. Then a phone booth either side. I could put a... I could put a brick wall there. Which makes it look a bit better. And I normally do something like that anyway. Yeah, we'll do that. Why not? So we'll get ten more prisoners arriving shortly. Let's go ahead and go to connections. Phone tap. Connect those phones up. And I think some flooring. Honestly, I think getting the flooring in would be of some benefit. Couldn't go with white tiles in here. Straight up build. In here, wooden floor. In fact, I think... No, maybe not wooden floor across the whole thing. Um, I think... Ceramic. No, mosaic would look nice. Give it something a bit different. In here, it's concrete tiles. Followed by mosaic. And there's a lot of money spent. But spent in the right place to try and make this thing look a little bit better. Why are all these prisoners just not being escorted? Ten available. Escort prisoner to cell. They're being searched. But they're not being escorted. Why not? Staff needs... We've got a couple of criticals in there, but it should be fine. We are nowhere near our capacity. So why are they not being escorted? I've just got another f four guards. And there's some more prisoners as well. I'm not sure. I'm not sure why that, why that was occurring. How strange. Anyway. Have ordered flooring. That is in there. I can see that. In here is going to be a similar thing. It says no one assigned to eat that canteen. Looks like they're going out. But it is in there. Canteen is in there. Just going to double check our programs. They're running fine. 15 interested guys. I could probably stop the first one. I don't think I need all of those. We're going to keep running the general education and foundation education program. Similar for alcoholic scoop therapy and pharmacological treatment to drug addiction. Parole hearing is fine. Spiritual is good. And we haven't done behavioral therapy and no one's in the queue anywhere. So that's fine. Anything we need to unlock in bureaucracy. Recycling initiative takes advantage of the government's going green initiative. Rewarding your prison daily worth of 10 for every bag of recycling that's collected. I'll unlock it. I don't know if we're actually going to use it, but I'll unlock it. See how we get on with it. And we are going to do a full, uh, a full shakedown tonight. We've got halfway through the inmate nutritional research. So we're going to go to our policy and go for high variety, high quantity. And then change our regime to have um, eat, eat, and then eat. One, two, three, four, five. That's that. Whoops. That. Then free time. Do you want to do it that way or the other way around? There. There. That seems more reasonable because it's four between. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. Anyway, cracking on with serving three high variety, high quantity meals per day. And we've got money for... Shop Sales Commission. Shake down all sectors. That's 345 places. Oh, we have a tunnel. Francis Clockwork Gallius. Prison number 3452571. Sentenced to two years for video game piracy. They've done the foundation education program. I'm working through it. Mm, not a great success chance. Failed parole hearing. They have a 47% chance of 
reoffending. Punishment is at zero, although that's going to change now. But the first tunnel. We have a tunnel. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm not going to bother trying to remove that tunnel just yet. I'll wait to see, see if I can find any others. Danger level is increasing. It's bound to increase. We're searching. People are going to say they've been unnecessarily searched recently. And then we're going to disagree. The... Contraband that we're finding... Whoa, loads over there. But it's not showing up here. See that? There's nothing here, but I saw stuff there. Yeah. Pocket watch doesn't show up on that list at the top. Gold pocket watch. That was thrown in. Why would you need a gold pocket watch? Also, why would you need one, two, three, four cell phones, a bottle of booze, a lighter, and a gold pocket watch? Savannah Sexton, prison number 3543280. 10 years for handing stolen goods. Well, it makes sense. <laughs> well. Why do they need all of that? Well, that's because it's in their nature, I guess. That's uh, what they were known for when they were on the outside, handling stolen goods. And what are they known for the inside? Handling stolen goods. Fair enough. Okay, okay. <laughs> Prison's starting to look a lot better now. Yeah, we've got all this flooring going in, which is good. Uh, obviously, these family cells are... We could probably put some TVs in. It would be probably better to, to do that, but... Like I say, my main thing at this stage is I want to get flooring in. I really want to get flooring in and like finish some of the other stuff around here. Like, for example, go to objects and medical beds and put in some medical beds. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Might as well do that. Again, it's, it's money, but it's money that I want to sort of spend to get this place looking nice. I'm going to go with a nice cargo floor. And all of this. The laundry will be white tiles. And we're receiving six grand a day. So it's not as if this money is going to, you know. It's not as if we have absolutely no money whatsoever. It's still fine. And we're getting early release. I reckon we'll have grading now. Yes. Whoa. Okay. 11 prisoners have been released. Reoffending rate is at 31%. That's bad. Punishment is law three reform. Middling at four. Security is okay at one. Health is at minus one. That's probably because of the overdoses. And there's not much I can really do to stop it. I've got patrols. I've got dogs. I've got metal detectors. The only thing I haven't got is um, a scanner for the stuff coming in here. Maybe that's a way to fix that. I think, I think actually that might be the way to fix it. I might have talked myself into doing it like that. Okay, over to utilities and to a... Is it not in there? Is it not in there? Might not have it. I Do we not have a scanner? Uh, it might be DLC and I've got all the DLC turned off for the most part. Well, not for the most part. I have got all the DLC turned off. Hmm. Okay, so I can't scan it. No matter. No matter. Currently sleep time. Which is all okay. Um, how do I want to proceed? I think I want to proceed over here. Building brick. Let's get this done. This is going to be a gym and library and cleaning cupboard. That's what that's going to be. Flooring as well. Concrete. It's going to go down there. And I like that all of this is now got some flooring in. Also, I realise there's no lights in the morgue. It's already a <clears throat> bit of a dark place, so we should probably put some lighting in there at least. So, yeah. Okay. Not so bad. Let's just uh, remove tunnels. It's only the one area. And it's not very far, that tunnel. We'll get that done. I've said prioritise, but I don't know if you can do that. In terms of needs, everything's in the everything's in the green for the most part. 
any medium need is, you know, it's there. Uh, literature need is going up and we've got some high needs, so hopefully a library will help us out there. There's Lutheran, Emma Lutheran. Yeah, they've... Oh, indeed. Uh, gonna dismantle these doors. These all go... Look at the delay on that. <laughs> I clicked on it and it was a two or three second delay. Right. Walls and doors, brick wall. Put the brick wall in. It's gonna come down. Um, I think what I'll do is have a... Hmm, I don't want one there. I don't actually need, to be fair. I don't even need this connection, I don't think. Certainly for, for the library, maybe. Maybe. So, staff door there, staff door there. Gym, we don't need one. Um, for the gym, we'll have... That in there. For the library, we'll have... That in there and that in there. So like that. Doesn't really matter. There's all the walls and doors in. And then we'll get those rooms done. So getting about five grand, five and a half grand per day. That will increase once we finish this grant. Not just for the 15 grand for completing the grant. But also the uh, extra cash for putting the meal quantity and variety down to normal levels. When I say normal, like a medium level. <clears throat> That is our normal level. 15 grand completion is now done. Uh, no other grants that we can pick up. No loans that we have to uh, pay back, which is good, I guess. And what's our valuation? 300,000 and we could sell some shares if required, but we don't need to. So over to policy, medium quantity, medium variety. Back to regime and it is going to be uh, work slash lockup, which will go in the middle. And there we go. Good, so these are now done. Let's go ahead and get everything in. So over to rooms, over to a gymnasium, which is going to go up the top there. We're going to have also, if I can find it, a library, which will go in here. And a cleaning cupboard, which I'm not even going to try and find. I'm just going to search for a cleaning cupboard, which will go there. And we also have, we, we already have some chemicals over on the right-hand side. Yeah, you go, got bleach over there, so chemicals are over there. Um, let's unpause that, go over to utilities and electrical cable. We're going to run that in like so. That should power up everything there actually we can probably just run it to there for being a bit frugal and cleaning cupboard is now in library is not let's go ahead and go to objects and we need a library shelf and a sorting desk so the library shelves i will go one two three four five that should be fine and then a sorting desk which will have one two three and like so job done gymnasium will require um require a boxing ring which we'll put a boxing ring um in here and we'll have what shall we have we've got dumbbell racks gym mats treadmills we'll have some treadmills so we'll put some treadmills oh they're quite expensive though treadmills one two three four five we're gonna go for maybe some it doesn't recommend weights benches which is strange we're gonna go with dumbbell sets on this side like so followed by gym mats in front of it um, I mean, you can just put table tennis in here as well and drinks machines and such. I mean, would another, actually, would two boxing rings be good? We could fit two boxing rings in, but I don't think I'm going to do that. There's a training dummy. They may learn new fighting skills. And no, uh, that's not happening. There's a water cooler, which we can put in. I don't think we need it because it's all it does is improves a prison's grade. Same for the drinks machines. Um, punching bag though. I guess we can have a couple of punching bags in. Huh. Is that not in the middle? Is there no middle for this? I might have to alter that then. No, 13. So it's odd. So dismantle. Put the, uh, put the wall back in. And then if I want to put some more stuff in here I can. But I think that's now reasonable. There's the box and match it. Uh, boxing match, boxing ring in. That's been removed. Place that in there. And as for the flooring, naturally concrete tiles in the middle. 
concrete tiles there, similar thing there, and it's already in there. For the gymnasium, wooden floor makes sense. For the library, wooden floor makes sense. For the cleaning cupboard, a white tiles makes sense as well. Okay, good. Um, we were talking about this, weren't we? Really. But I'm a bit concerned. What's power like? Power's not great. I'm a bit concerned about the amount of prisoners that we have. Um, I think I need a. I think I need to clone this. So, over to quick build and cloning. Selecting all of that, I can rotate. I can also flip, and that gives us an exact copy. But it's blocked, so I can't place it there. But I can if I do this. Rotate it, flip it. Blocked? Why blocked? Ah. It'll, it'll be that. No. Can't place it anywhere. That's very strange. Why can't I place that? It says it's blocked wherever I go to place it. How curious. Is it that footbridge? What if I was to build it like that? No. Okay. That's curious. I don't know why that is the case. Okay. When in doubt, manually build it. I'll go in there. Doors, staff door, job done. This requires an entrance. Okay. We get that done. Large jail door. From here. Scroll up. Click. And there we go. Well, I said I was going to build this, whatever this happens to be, this episode, but it looks like I'm going to change my mind and focus on, on that. But we're going to leave it there for now anyway. That's been a bit of Prison Architect. Lots of flooring. More capacity. More grants completed. Good money, good intake. Good management. Terrible grading. Absolutely terrible grading. Um, how many family members do we know? We have one, two, three, four, five? Five. Yeah. Okay. And there's... Uh, there's that person again kicking off because of the... Uh, well, volatile nature of their being. Okay. So this is now in. So we're going to leave it there for now. That's been a bit of Prison Architect. Next episode, I want to get in the other kitchen and canteen. And frankly finish that yard and get whatever this is basically just progress on and get to a stage where the majority of this if not all of it is completed we'll see how we get on as always hope you have enjoyed this episode and the series thus far comments in the comments thanks very much for watching take care and generic partings